Welcome to this week's IOTA Quick Takes. Big things are happening, huge, so let's dive in. The moment we've all been waiting for is almost here. On May 5th, 2025, at 9 a.m. Central European Time, we'll officially launch the fully decentralized rebased IOTA mainnet. This is the beginning of a new era for IOTA and for decentralized tech. Check out the recent blog post and mark your calendars, and be sure to check out two key X spaces for more insights. The IOTA rebased town hall with Dom and the team, and IOTA goes staking. Your deep dive into validators, staking, and the road to mainnet launch. Both sessions are available on our X channel, so catch up and stay in the loop. But that's not all. We've also seen two dApp launches on the IOTA rebase testnet. Swirl brings liquid staking to IOTA. That's right, you can stake and receive tokens and get a sneak peek at what decentralized finance on IOTA will look like. Check out the Swirl testnet app at testnetswirlstake.com.app. Pools Finance is the first decentralized exchange on the IOTA rebase testnet, using an automated market maker model, perfect for native token swaps, on-chain price discovery, and liquidity provisioning. Try it out now at www.pools.finance. Next up, IOTA East Africa Web3 Innovation Summit. On May 30th in Nairobi, Kenya, we're partnering with key players to bring you a one-day event focused on how decentralized technologies can transform trade, logistics, and sustainability. Expect live demos, expert panels, and hands-on workshops. Check out the recent post on our official blog for details. And finally, Starfish is our groundbreaking Byzantine fault-tolerant consensus model designed for DAG-based networks. It's the next evolution of Mysticity, proving that strong fault tolerance, high performance, and low communication overhead can coexist in DAG networks. Lots of testing and validation still to come, but in the meantime, read the white paper under Academic Papers on the Our Research page of the IOTA Foundation website. That was a lot. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.